Nice to meet you. Um, I'm from the University of Pretoria in South Africa, and I'm a NEF fellow. Um, my research is focused on developing novel, non-invasive ways um, to diagnose and screen for various conditions in Africa. Africa is really ready for this kind of uh, research that we are doing or that most NEF fellows are doing in the sense that uh, new technologies are coming up and uh, many African governments are uh, listening and are taking up the opportunity to introduce these uh, technologies in different fields. Uh, one of the big challenges we have in Africa is that we have really big gap for the scientists in Africa to be really in, let's say, uh, in a hot topic in science and technology. And that is because uh, one of the things is like we are disconnected from the rest of the world. In the sense that governments have the possibility and the capacity to create an enabling, an enabling environment for good research to happen. I feel like being part of the executive and really learning about things that work and things that didn't work will really help me in a position as chair to try and push us in a direction where we all stay engaged and we all stay motivated. Come people, stretch out your able hands across these vast African lands. Don't be constrained by the discipline divide and tap into the richness of our African pride. Water, land, food and energy. Bring forth solutions for our own liberty. For a better, brighter tomorrow. Let us lead, not just follow. Let the vo world hear our voice. Let's awake. Future Africa. The community of scientists had a successful meeting today and there was a lot of um, progress that was made in terms of bringing uh, all of the community members to the same page in terms of the progresses that have been made, the efforts that went into and also the future plans. Uh, and it was an incredible uh, to see that starting from the September 2017 in, in Kigali, the first meeting, to now, there has been a lot of um, trust that went into uh, the community that we can actually do contribute a lot in making the transformation of Africa to a knowledge-based economy, and we can play a definite role. And that was uh, very, very obvious to see that everyone had bought that idea, and they were willing to contribute uh, in, in many ways. And partly, for example, everyone was willing to contribute in groups, uh, helping the executive committee uh, that is running uh, the, the committee of scientists, but also having uh, different insights. People were giving us our, their feedback and how to improve. And that was really something that I was very happy to see.